You're watching the seeding round of competition here on the opening day of the Margaret River Pro. Italo Ferreira, John Duro, and Frederico Marias in the lineup now here at the main break of Margaret River. Finished off the seeding round for the women, so they have a couple of scary heats ready to go in the elimination round. If you end up in third, that's where you end up to try to avoid a 33rd place result. A surfer that's sitting in last place without a big result can show up at the next event and take down the world. That's how insane the tour is these days. Backside hack for Italo, solid. Clean carve on the open face. Throw some water on that third turn to kick out with a starting wave here with 25 minutes to go. They couldn't even uh, get a, a couple of maneuvers on the board, but looking strong here. A couple of beautiful turns from Italo. Wave going a little sleepy at the end, but three solid maneuvers. And starting to stand up out the back. Italo starts with a four. Deep on this one is Frederico Marias. Big snap to start for the surfer from Portugal. Front side carb, solid. Watch how he sort of sets it up here as he comes off the bottom and sort of jams it up through the lip, but it's more of a drifting turn. And then you get those big wrapping maneuvers for, from the front siders. And then if you look at the backhand approach, it's a, a little bit in, a different in contrast, but gets the fins out the back there, cut that turn short, stepped on the fins and, and kind of did a little bit of a fade, which wiped off a lot of speed. For Frederico, carb to snap combinations. Here's Duru. There's that timing once again with the lip line and coils up and hacks it for a nice way to get on the board. Yeah, great way to get on the board for Joan Duru. And it's that classic example of uh, the front side versus the backside attack. Fade and, and it did exactly the same, but this turn right here from Joan Duru straight up through the lip, that's a hard thing to do on your front side and get. The same amount of power out of your turns. Joan Deru looking sharp here at the get-go. Nice jamming maneuver in the pocket and then fades straight down off the bottom. He gets that board nice and vertical, throwing a lot of spray in the air. So Joan Deru looking sharp right here. So surfers like Savannah Lima really struggling with the wind. Here comes Duru, ready to hack away again. Smooth bottom turn, not much wave to work with. He chases the pocket. Fades it one more time and runs out of water on that inside shelf. But what a start into the seven range, backing it up quickly there. And moving out the back with a sense of urgency. Finaling at Portugal, fifth of pipe to finish 22 right on the cutoff mark. What happened on this one? Wow, I mean, he, it's a good little backup. That's what I think. Uh, I, I think he just wanted to get a second wave on the board, which he's done 3.17, so not a bad little backup. So it's given him that two wave total. Because they always have right away. Duru is going to chase this one down under priority. There's that reliable vertical. End section doesn't give him any room. His backup score a 317 at the moment. His family started traveling with him towards the end of last year when he really needed a big result. Juan Deru is starting to surf, you know, it's uh, most of the year it's almost like a, a caged animal and then all of a sudden those doors are open and here he goes. Frederico Marias starts with a clean forehand whip through the whitewater, second one complete. Into a third turn, similar motion and all three hacks down the line. And now has another score to go along with a 5-3-3, just keep your best two rides this wave and then got himself back out into that number one priority uh, position. Frederica Marais, beautiful opening maneuver. I like the, the just the low deep bottom turns from Marais. Fun looking wave setting up for Italo. Always has speed, comes down under the lip, perfect bottom turn. Shows some power on that backhand jam in the pocket. Setting up some backside snaps, trying to reverse it in a tight space. All the turns there for him, and then watch this maneuver here from Italo. Straight off the bottom again, and then whammo, right in the pocket. Beautiful transition between that combination of turns. And as he always does, shows so much energy through each and every ride. Watch how he just gets his transition float up and over the lip there, 
free falls, lands, and then straight into the turn. I mean, that was beautiful stuff there from Italo Ferreira, right in the pocket, right in the guts of the wave where all the power is, and then vertical. So a great combination of turns there for Italo Ferreira. Just sitting on a four-point ride at the moment. Duro is some clear water for the back end round. And he'll kick out right in front of Italo and paddle aggressively for second priority. Frederico Moraes in there as well. 15 minutes on the clock. To move up into number two spot. 6.10 6 required. Juan Daru trying to better a 3.17. 5.17 on the backup. Italo jumped into second and Frederico Moraes replacing Mikey Wright in this event. Is trying to make it count. Wind up for the full rotation. Ferreira explodes off the lip and celebrates that ride. Fun just to see a big air. Because we haven't seen a whole lot of that today, Potts. No, we haven't, Joe. And uh, I think it's a sign of things to come, maybe. Third in line for priority. So uh, what does he do? He picks up a, a, a below average wave. Literally a close out and goes for broke. Gets that full rotation going. Italo Ferreira needing a 6.02 to get the lead off Juan Daru. Let's have a look again. The, the spring in the step, the rotation, the body, everything in perfect sync. And an absolute full rotation of land facing the beach. Italo Ferreira, you are a superhuman. Thank you very much for coming, he says. <laughs> Can torque his body around and land seamlessly in transition. Here comes Juan Daru off the bottom. Duru finishing with a couple of backside turns and stepping on the white water until he runs out of room on the inside. Italo Ferreira has just taken the lead off Duru with the big full rotation punt, 6.9 for the effort. So Duru went to second, now he's a 6.06. He's a bit more to move right into the next round. Yeah, Joan Duru trying to fight his way back into that number one spot. That waves like Choku Tahiti, pipeline where all the critics were saying he needed to prove something. It didn't take him long at all. He's coming up next. Frederico Mariah's power carve off the top. Set up work down the line, and he'll jam the rooftop with that vertical attack. Oh, at the coffee shop around the corner, because he's <laughs> always fired up. How'd Frederico do here? Yeah, big opening maneuver from Frederico. Little check turn there, and then that vertical finish. He kind of was looking for more, and the reef kind of fit in one more turn. He's down. Here comes Italo. A little bit more pep in his step. He'll blast the fins out. Quickly hitting it off the lip. Touching the inside corner, and he's got more for us. Little redirect on the dry rock oh section. God. He somehow <laughs> sneaks out of there. Italo Ferreira, first jam in the pocket. I mean, you can tell definitely more pep in the step after that. Backside rotator, just going to town on this one all the way through the inside. Beautiful check turn there from Ferreira, and finishing that one off. Italo, a couple of scores in the six-point range. Can he break out of it? Can he break free? This is beautiful surfing from him, connecting nicely. Just seamless transition. A variety of repertoire. And total commitment right at the end here exactly what the judges are looking for as Frederico pulls himself up onto the rock. Amazing stuff there from both those guys. And waves continue to pulse out the back. Hard off the bottom, blowing the whole board out the back is Marias. But he can't hang on. Marias hoping for a 6-2-8 to move into the top two. Here comes Duro up and out. With Frederico paddling back out, he offs to hold that position out the back. And a big decision about to go down in the matchup. 2.15 to go. Italo takes the first wave. Nice, clean backhand connection. Driving his whole board around for the reverse. Explosive two-turn combination. Now Frederico needs to really dig in here. Clean front side wrap holding that rail line, but he's running out of wave height here. Surfing it well, ditching the fins, but he's got to kick out early. That'll leave Duru out the back. I mean, one more win for Italo. He's already matched with Julian Wilson in a short period of time for event wins. As we run out of time, Italo Ferreira, 7-1-3, takes a big win. Joan Duru, 
stays in second. And Frederico Marias, the injury replacement wild guard for Mikey Wright, will have to deal with the elimination round of competition here at the Margaret River Pro.